Hey, I'm just Vosco and this is Just Gear City. Now, filming this episode I've had a bit of a problem where my microphone um, didn't work. Now, I know I should save each episode on a separate save file, but I'm an idiot and don't. When I finish recording the episode, I normally save it. Um, as long as there's been no issues in the recording, I save it. Um, so I went to do all the editing of the video and things like that, and then I realised there was no audio to it. Um, and it turns out that my drivers were failed or something like that. I've clearly fixed the problem now because I'm talking to you, but sadly... There is no audio for this video, which is a shame because we got quite a lot done in this video. We carry on making cars for the army, which is bringing in a nice amount of money. But to put it in context, in this episode, I upgrade my factory twice and still have plenty of money left over. Um, some of the things I covered in this episode, the first episode has gone out... Just, bef uh, just before recording this episode. And I recorded the first three episodes in one block. So I, if you've watched the other two episodes, I haven't responded to comments on the first video, which I got quite a few. I was really impressed. People seem quite happy that the series is back on the channel. I really like seeing the likes and the comments. So keep them coming in. Um, but yeah, the reason I didn't comment in episode two about that was because they'd already been recorded. Um, a lot of you are really helpful, give me a lot of advice, and I try and remember it all. My memory sucks really bad, um, so I pick up certain things. For example, um, someone was telling me... I do apologise. Uh, I would look back on the comments in episode one and you'll see who I'm talking about. Um, that I have to keep producing um, products to improve my, improve my building quality i know what i'm trying to say so from now on i'm going to try and build um engines chassis and gearboxes more regularly so we do build one as you can see here we're building a straight five straight engine five cylinder i'm learning um it actually turns out cheaper than the v and probably just as good uh, what else have we done we did a gearbox and a chassis which you'll see me do after this um it did this um thingy engine that we're doing now um then we carry on producing cars taking contracts i did have an issue later on in the video where i try to do two contracts and i'm producing the suv and then i get a contract for the van well i put a production line on the van but it just doesn't produce it the suv is still being produced but the van won't produce in the factory and i don't know why um so if anyone knows what's going on there I'd be very grateful if you can explain it to me because I just the SUVs are producing a thousand odd at a time which is exactly what we want and all we wanted to do was put one uh, production line on the vans and that failed terribly it just wouldn't do it it would not produce it so we failed that contract and got fined for it which is a little annoying when I've got plenty of workforce like plenty of um, production lines to do it on um what else have we done we at the end of the episode to get to the point where i'm about to make my own car um now it's not always like a lot of people there's some tips i had in one of the comments about um leasing the rights to a car or leasing a car and selling it under our own name and those are all really good suggestions and you know what if i wasn't making so much money off these army contracts i would definitely have gone down that route but i do have the money so i'm quite interested to see about producing my own cars especially whilst the money is still coming in so we might as well do it during the war so once the war's over we can start shipping them out uh, really expand the business get a few um, branches across the globe probably in the main cities like uh, london paris most of the capitals because they tend to have the the biggest population um now here we're just playing around with the what are we playing around with we're playing around with the gearbox is this or is this still the engine no this is still the engine um and again it does turn out i really like how this engine turns out the, and the chassis turns out great and the gearbox so i think they'll be a great combination together um once a year's up i'm probably just going to produce another three i'm going to try and produce um a set every year 
Um, and that should get our, our manufacturing skill um, boosted, from what I can gather. Uh, we will definitely look into buying, once we get some more money, we're looking to buy shares into other companies, try and take some over, um, sell off bits we don't need. I, I, I'm really going to look into actually renting the rights to a car so I can sell it under my name, leasing it, I don't know what you call it, but I think that's quite a good idea. If our cars that we start producing fail, that is definitely an option. Um, we could also open our own products up to people that they're paying to use them. I think that is an option as well. So there's a lot I've never done in this game that I'm looking into. For example, I've never done contracts in this game. And I don't know why I've never done them because they're really good. We make some money off them. The war is working in our favour in all fairness. Uh, we've got quite a large factory now, 13 pro uh, production lines. Um, so we're ready to go once the war ends and we've got our vehicles ready to go i will introduce the suv to the market and the van i'll introduce to the market um why not we, we've made our money on the suvs definitely we haven't made any money on the vans because it won't let me produce them which is again annoying um now you're going to have two episodes on the same day with this so this one i could talk all the way through it but it's not going to match up with what's going on the screen so I just thought I'd put this up for anyone who wants to watch it. Um, so this will be like episode 4.1. And then we've got episode 4.2 that came out at the same time, which is a proper video to make up for the lack of sound in this video. Um, if you enjoy either of those videos, please hit the like button and subscribe. And until next time, I'll see you again.